I think we've always tried to support Irish films, but I think there's always been a sort of like sense of trying to to find ways to put them into the big slots, into the into the, the Savoy slots, into the galas, and we're opening and closing with two, I think, of the strongest Irish films in years. I think Calvary is actually going to be one of those films we'll be talking about for a very long time, not least because Brendan Gleeson's probably come of age in a way. You know, we've seen him progress through the ranks of being a fantastic supporting actor, somebody who's always been the sort of uh, sort of the, the, the sort of I suppose the quiet man nearly in the films, but this is an incredible performance. I mean, I actually think this is up there with the performances that we expect from people like Daniel Day-Lewis. We're going to put our Cine Talent Award this year is actually going to be open to the public. So it'll be really curious. They can vote for the talent that they see as the most, uh, I suppose, impressive uh, amongst the Irish films in the festival. And I think that'll be interesting to see. We've always championed our audiences and said they're the people that we show the films for. But let's get them voting and actually get them involved in deciding who they think are the people, you know, who we'll be talking about in 20 years' time. It's thrilling. Um, I've always loved Dublin and it's an Irish film and love Eternal and I'm just really looking forward to seeing it with a Dublin audience and hearing, you know, the uh, what they think about suicide and death and hope and love and transformation. There's so much wonderful independent film that doesn't get seen in the mainstream and audiences get to come and see these kind of movies and they have a, you know, it's just much more of a connected experience, I think, uh, for an audience at a festival. But also there are some films that don't get beyond festivals, you know, that don't get a DVD release and they're worthy movies, so it's great that, that they get an opportunity to celebrate and, and be seen. Well, the script came together reasonably quickly. Peter and I outlined it together uh, over the course of a couple of months, and then the, the money to make it came from the Irish Film Board shortly after that. But we filmed it last November, uh, and then the edit was quite long. So I guess maybe that's something that um, a lot of comedies have. You know, you have to edit it, and then you have to screen it and see where the jokes, how the jokes are working, and then maybe go back and edit some more. So, yeah, a reasonably long process, but it was great fun. Um, it's really important. This is an audience film. You know, it's a comedy, and. Uh, and, and the most important thing for comedies is they play in front of uh, a, an audience, you know. And, and sometimes with festivals, it can be hard for comedy because it's not a genre that uh, that usually fits in the festival world. But if you can play at a cinema like the Savoy, and if you can get an Irish film to play in a cinema that size, then you've got a huge advantage in getting it out into the world. So we're all uh, thrilled, absolutely delighted.